Hey guys, it's Danny. Welcome back to my channel. And as you guys can see in the title, today's video is gonna be my Costa Rica vlog. Not just a Costa Rica vlog, a solo birthday Costa Rica vlog. Period. Right now it's 12 10 a.m. I need to leave by like 4 to get to the airport and I still have not packed because I had to I literally just finished recording a try and haul and then my boo came over and look what he got me off. Aren't these so pretty? Oh my god! He loves me. And these are so huge. Like they literally are so big. Like look at my flowers. He also got me this teddy flower, which is also so cute. And he said this is my early birthday gift since I'm not gonna be here for my birthday. My birthday is in now two days because it's October 9th. My birthday is the 11th and I won't be here for my birthday. So he said he had to give me something before I left. So yeah, I really, I'm so in love with my flowers. And then it also came with a vase. It was wrapped up, but I took it out the wrapper because I had it in the vase. I got to put that in water. I do not want to leave those. Anyway, y'all, I'm about to actually start packing and the next time you guys see me is most likely going to be when I'm on my way to the airport. Yeah. actually boarding now but I always like wait I try not to be like the last person because either way you still gotta wait like regardless I'm like mad tired y'all I did not get no sleep last night like I was up all night I'm exhausted but I'm excited because this is my seventh solo trip and all of them are on my channel so if you're new to my channel make sure you guys go check out all my uh travel vlogs my solo ones and the ones that i've traveled with people i'm so excited i'm just tired y'all i'm sorry about the low energy i'm just tired I actually just coordinated a pickup from the airport so i don't have to do it when i get there and guess how much is gonna be y'all yeah so like i was saying i actually scheduled a pickup from the airport with my host and like i was saying I contacted my host and asked her if she knew like a uh, reliable like trustworthy driver to pick me up from the airport just so I won't get scammed because I had already asked her how far the Airbnb was from the airport and when I looked it up it was like almost two hours like an hour and a half two hours away and I'm like yeah that might be expensive and I know how people like to how taxi drivers specifically like to scam they said it was gonna be 180 to take me there and honestly I feel like I'm still getting scams. I don't know, but you know, I gotta get there either way. So we're gonna see, we're gonna see what happens. Bienvenidos a la ciudad de San José de Costa Rica, donde la hora local son las 11 y 20 de la mañana. Costa Rica most known for? Normally it's casados. Casados? It's rice, beans, salad, mm -hmm. and then the meat. Okay. Chicken, fish, or pork. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you know a good spot like on the way to yeah, get that? Sure. Okay. It's, it's like 45 minutes, one hour. Okay. Here. It's okay? Yeah. You're from here, right? No, from Kepos. You're from Kepos? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I drive like 7.30 in the morning. Oh to, my god. To the airport. I'm getting souvenirs which I love because I always end up doing this last minute when I'm on vacation. Literally doing it in the beginning just makes life so much easier. Every time I go to 
to a different country, I always get a shot glass. So I'm looking at the shot glasses right now. Y'all know I want a pink one. And I'm thinking if I should get my um, boyfriend one too, because he's an alcoholic right now. That's a joke. That's a joke for my mom because she's always calling me an alcoholic. I'm not an alcoholic, but she just thinks that just because I drink, I'm an alcoholic for whatever reason. Touch that fire for you. I do that three more times again. I testify for you. I told I like you, that bitch. I do it all that I'm around. You're scared to do I'm not. As long as you're joking, now it's for me. I ain't got it. Normally, it's a lot of coconuts here. Right now, it's too dirty like, because it's raining every day. Once right there. Where? Did you see it? No. No? This one, very close to the... He moved. Oh, I see it, I see it. <laughs> normally you see like a lot? A lot. Maybe normally it's like 50, 80 really? coconut here. Yeah. Because normally in Costa Rica, if you find a coconut in any river, mm -hmm. you call 911, they go in to catch it, and then bring to this one. Oh, bridge. really? Yeah. What's the name of this bridge? Tarcoles. Let me change that. That thing? No. <laughs> <laughs> you have a lot today. Is the water deep or you don't know? It is? Yeah, but no good place for sleep. <laughs> <laughs> no good luck. We tried though. <laughs> it's okay. I've been skinny, blue, and I joke body. Alright, this is so pretty. Ain't no problem. I don't got nobody just with you right now. But the truth, I look better. Your restaurant, different kind of food. Mm -hmm. Gelateria, some store. Then you have uh, the main beach, Playa Espadilla. Then you have the National Park. Then you have uh, Playa Bisan. Very different beach compared to the other beach because it's no way. It's very cold. Out. You have to tell to Wilbur. Let's go to Catarat, to the Catarata. It's an inside to the property. So if Fabio told me you have a Catarata kill, Wilbur. <laughs> okay. Hi. Welcome to Casa Liberty. Thank you. Look at this, the monkey is here. The monkey is here. Welcome to Casa Liberty. Oh my God. This is the monkey, small monkey. Happy? Oh, thank you. Okay. It's okay, I got okay. it. <laughs> thank you. Va para allá. Aquí, 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 please. Welcome to Casa Liberty. Nani, is this your home? Oh my god, guys. They're so cute. Yes, it's coming in the, in the morning, in the after. Really? Yeah, all the around. It's coming. Uh, this is a small monkey, Titi. Uh, Titi. The animal I like this tree. This tree, the name is Guarumo. Guarumo. I have the fruit for the different animal, monkey, tucan. Okay. 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 No. Okay. no. Oh my god. Mega. Hmm. Mega. Okay, information for the house this for connection Wi-Fi and function TV. Okay. I have two options to food to restaurant Arado uh -huh. and to pick artisanal to Nino Kepos down. Okay. The people have to live here. Okay. You like to pay the credit card or cash? No oh, problem. Oh yes, good, 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 you, good, good. No problem. Okay, good, good, good. All you say, Casa Liberty, eh, the guy is coming. Great, great, You great. have my number telephone? Yes. You contact with me in WhatsApp. Uh -huh. You see, will I need to food? Uh -huh. No problem. Oh, the restaurant thank you so much. Wait, I'm vlogging for YouTube. Do you mind? No problem. You sure? No problem. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Okay. Uh, this is the keys. Okay. For the house. Mm -hmm. Number two for the gate for this house. Mm -hmm. For open, for close, number two. Okay. When you need to go um, to taxi, you tell me, I put the taxi for you, Fabio, or Fabio not working, other friends. Thank you so much. This is the house. Okay. Okay, everything is ready for you. Thank you so um, much. You like to see the pool right now? Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. The light is automatic. Okay. okay. The light automatic here. Okay. From here is for the pool. I stay here in this house with my, my wife, my wife, this husband, okay. and my baby. Oh. I stay here. This is my baby. Hey. Hola. Hola, much gusto. Mucho gusto. Katie, diga hola, Dani. Hola, mamá. Hi. Hola, Dani. Bienvenida. Bienvenida. Gracias. <laughs> okay, we're well, answering. So ya vengo, mi amor. In the night, I have to lie up to here, Dani. Okay. Animal, birds. Really? Birds, and other round. I have to lie automatic in the night. Okay. <laughs> it's okay for me to take pictures and stuff, right? Yes, Okay. Only. You have the pictures here, the video. No problem. Cool. I hope it's coming that to can to can and something that is coming with the sun. They clack, clack, clack. <laughs> Every day. The pool is full time. Okay. 
so pretty. Ah! <laughs> so pretty. Oh, the animal is coming today. This is the big. I uh, here is coming the small uh -huh. and the big. This is the big. That one's the big one. Yeah, the big one. Oh. Look at. Hey guys, so I finally made it to my Airbnb. As you guys saw, like I uh, started vlogging when Wil Wilbur was showing me around, but my camera died, so I just changed my battery. And I want to give you all an official tour of just my inner part, and then we'll do the outside later. So this is my view outside. It's so pretty, and this is literally where we were just looking at the monkeys, but it was so hot, so my camera was fogging. This is my spot. And then I'm just gonna slide the door. And this is what it first looks like. So originally I thought this was it. And I was I was like happy with just this because this is so cute. I have my own kitchen. I have my own fridge right here with complimentary water, ice, a stove, even have like um pots and stuff if I want to cook but I'm not because obviously I want to experience real Costa Rican food so I'm going to be ordering food but I also have a microwave a coffee maker sink blender oh my god I should have brought my protein oh my god toaster and then over here I have some like um dishware and stuff like that a table and then I thought this was my bed right here right here he explained this already but i thought this is my bed then i looked over here y'all and there's more there's more so once you turn there's this door right here which is just like a little closet not little but a closet and then right here is the bathroom this bathroom is so freaking cute oh my god look at that that's so cute the shower is dope and then I have two sinks. This is the toilet. That's pretty. I literally have two sinks. Right now I'm charging my other camera battery because like I said, it died. But this is so cute. Whoever does that is dope as hell. But yeah, two sinks. Okay, and then once I come out the bathroom, um, don't mind my suitcase. This is another closet space where I just threw my bags in there so it won't be um, inside the video while I'm doing this haul. And then here is my bed. Oh my God. You would think that I did not even see what this looked like when I was booking it. But this is my bed and I have a TV here. This is fire AC up there and fan. And I still have another view from right here. And I can also come out from right here too if I want to but and this also slides if I needed to this slides this is fire like Wilbur said this is my home for the next few days and it's so pretty like oh my god this is literally what I needed I needed uh, to get away like somewhere where it's not like busy for this birthday i did not want to do anything where it's like chaotic partying like i really wanted to be somewhere that's just serene where i can just rest and it be peaceful and i feel like i chose the perfect place like i'm right in the middle of a freaking jungle like are you kidding me i'm in the middle of a jungle like how much more peaceful can that does it get than that i absolutely absolutely love love this airbnb right now i'm trying to post pictures i'm not gonna lie the wi-fi is not wi-fi right now it is not where did i sit my phone at oh gosh it's taking forever for me to post this picture it's still loading on instagram i'm trying to post this picture because right now it's 505 here but 705 in new york and normally i like to post my pictures like around three no later no later than three so this is posting really late but i really want it to be up today so i can start posting so my next post will be on my birthday tomorrow i'm gonna be taking pictures um tomorrow i'm gonna start tomorrow just because i don't feel like doing my makeup stuff right now like i just want to chill you know i i had a long journey here oh yeah let me set this here so we good oh let's talk let's talk i didn't really have a lot of time to like talk to you guys on my way here um because i just didn't but i did try to say this in the car i don't know if you guys heard me or not but the journey from here the journey 
here to my Airbnb from the airport was literally three like he, he told me it was gonna be about two and a half to three hours we got here probably like 30 minutes ago and we left the airport at 12 35 so that was literally four hours but we did stop to get some food that food was so good like when I say so good and some lady in the airport like <laughs> it was real cute because she just started randomly talking to me while I was on the line for immigration. She was just like randomly talking to me and she was like telling me everything about her life and like she asked me where I was from. I said New York and then she was telling me how her daughter lived in New York for like two years and da 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 whatever. But long story short, she told me that the food here is amazing. And that's not something I heard like when I was looking looking up. Oh my god, what happened? That wasn't something that I saw when I was like looking up costa rica because anytime i go somewhere i always look it up like i don't just visit a country just to visit it like i always do my little research especially when i'm solo traveling solo traveling like i said earlier this is my seventh solo country i've been to yeah so i didn't hear that and i'm not gonna lie i was not expecting that food to be that good like i would dead rate every single thing on that plate a 10 out of 10 like it was really really bomb thankfully he, um wilfer was telling me that they take card because i have no cash L okay that's the second thing the driver was charging me 180 to bring me here which obviously i think that's a really good deal for three hours like 180 is not bad however i asked for exact change exact 180 when i was at the airport and apparently the conversion did not convert right like they gave me like 20 dollars less in a cologne than what they were supposed to so instead of 180 they gave me 160 but they charged me for 180 and when i was at the airport i did the conversion and it didn't because i i said this i believe in my uh vlog my columbia vlog i always have my converter with me my currency converter i use the currency app i always use that app and it's always like pretty accurate and i did an airport and it wasn't converting to what they gave me but i was like uh i mean i know like conversions change like you know frequently sometimes so i'm like all right i don't know but yeah they definitely jipped me off in the airport like but um <laughs> i owe probably 15 dollars um and thankfully he was like really understanding about it i showed him my receipt and everything and like he saw that i did ask for 180 i don't know what they were doing at that place but yeah i don't fuck with that but yeah so pretty much that's it for right now the rest of the day i'm just gonna like chill relax enjoy um just being here because tomorrow i'm about to go in with taking pictures for my birthday you know i want to make sure i have like five different outfits i want to make sure if i can get four different outfit pictures in this trip i'm gonna be excited i've never i don't think i've ever done that so if i can get four different outfit pictures like that would be amazing so i think tomorrow is just gonna be an all day like photo shoot type thing and he has a spa place on here so it's kind of blurry, but I'm definitely, definitely gonna give me a little circle for my birthday. Wilbur was also telling me that um, I could hike to a waterfall, which I might actually do that tomorrow, to be honest. I might do that tomorrow. Um, and then also Bobby was telling me a few places that I definitely need to visit before I leave. So I'm gonna try to do everything um, while still resting because like i said this is not a this is not a adventure trip this is not let me wake up at 7 a.m so i can go zip lining and let me wake up at 8 a.m so i can da 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 like that's not really what i wanted for this trip this is really just a relaxing this 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 vacation was for me to relax and just catch up on just myself and get myself like at peace because a lot has just been going on i feel like i've been um too busy for myself recently and i don't like that that's never too good to be too busy for yourself so i just want to relax and just you know yeah just enjoy enjoy life that's what this that's what this vacation is for enjoying life i don't think there's really anything else i have to put y'all on to um but if i do remember something y'all know me i'll be back so yeah so i was about to try this candy that i got from the market earlier and i'm a sour candy person so i really really want to try it this that's why i got this one so i just want to get my reaction these look so freaking good this smells mad good too like as soon as i opened it i can smell it like i'm gonna grab one of the banana ones just because i seen monkeys already mm. 
Okay, I wasn't expecting that. Sorry, this hair shed so bad. I wasn't expecting that, but it actually has like a banana flavor taste. This is what, a dolphin? Okay, yeah, I like this. All right, one more, one more, one more. Okay, this is good. All right, one more. I'm gonna try this one with the little beady things on it. Okay, pretty good. Good morning, guys. It's my first official day. It goes Starica, go Starica, go Starica, go Starica. Period. I set my alarm for five o'clock so I can go out and watch the sunset. But when my alarm came on, I went back to sleep. I'm like, look, I got mad. Let's we'll see the sunset. I went back to sleep. Woke up at like 5.30, woke up again at like 6, 6.30, and then finally at 7, I'm like, all right, let me get up. I literally just got out the shower. I've been, right now, it's 9.10, so within these two hours, um, I was recording a house tour um, for an Instagram reel, and just chilling really pretty much. That shower is really good. I'm thankful that it has hot water because sometimes when you go to like places like this, like they don't be having hot water, but that hot water just less, less, but less. To get ready, like I told y'all today is gonna be picture day. I already have my outfit that I'm gonna wear. Let me show y'all. So this is the first fit. Um, I forgot the bag, but it's right. Oh, actually did I? Maybe I didn't. I'm gonna check, but this is the first fit. Look, my hair is like everywhere, y'all. Please don't ever get this hair that I got. And this is human hair. Like, I paid like $50 for this hair. It's just shedding everywhere. Like, I would have been better off just getting fake hair. Like, I should have just got fake hair. I hate this hair. And I think I said it in the beginning of the vlog. Like, by the time I come back from my trip, all these pieces are going to be out. And I was dead joking, but I, I'm pretty sure that all these pieces are going to be out. So, well, I am dressed and ready. Look at the iguana. Oh my god. That one's smaller than the other one though. So I just took some pictures. I'm not done yet. I'm just going back to the house to see if I um, actually did bring my pink bag because that would. Am I on the wrong way? No. Um, that would make my pictures like way more better. So as you guys saw, I started off taking pictures, but something told me, let me go back to the room and check my suitcase to see if I had a bag to go with this outfit and I did bring one thankfully now I'm about to start taking pictures again I'm out of breath because coming up this hill to get to the pool is a lot of fucking work okay hey guys so right now it is 12 o'clock on the dot 12 p.m and i just finished taking pictures i also went in the pool that's why i'm all wet this pool is so beautiful like the view not just the view but just the pool itself like everything about this place is just exactly what i wanted for my birthday it's just like magical right now i'm about to go inside i'm gonna order some food because i'm starving i didn't eat all day today guys i'm so upset so the place i originally wanted to order food from el arado is closed on tuesdays like what the I am so mad. Like, I am so upset. I was fiending for some more cassava. That, that was so good yesterday. Like, I really wanted that. But I guess I'll get it tomorrow. It is my birthday tomorrow. So I'll probably have that for lunch. And I think I want to go out to eat tomorrow. I'm not too sure. I don't know. I'll figure it out. The only other delivery thing that they have in here is, like, pizza. And I don't want pizza. I want Colombian food. But I don't feel like leaving the, um... I don't feel like leaving here right now yeah i really i really i really i really don't want like that's my main thing whenever i go out the country i like to eat what the locals eat i don't want to eat american food i don't want pizza i don't want hamburgers i don't want chicken nuggets like i can get that when i'm home like so when i go to a different country i always ask the locals my taxi person my driver whoever i come in contact with my host at my airbnb what is like the food here that what is like the local or national dish here that I need to try? Or what is something I absolutely need to try and I always get it? Because what's the point of going outside of the country and not experiencing that country? Like I really want to experience the country. That's the point. I'm gonna figure out what I wanna get from here and I'll come back once it comes. 
I look cute. Ooh. Hey, I look cute. I look cute. I look cute. Hey, my birthday's tomorrow. 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 My birthday's my birthday. Alright, let me stop because I'm hungry. <laughs> I'll be back. Okay, sight guys. Because oh my god, why doesn't this place open until two and it's fucking twelve o'clock? I have to wait two freaking hours to get some fucking food. Yo, I didn't anticipate. Bro, I would have went out this morning to get food. I might look up some more places and see if there's anything else that delivers because these are just the menus that he has here. It doesn't mean this, these are the only places that deliver. So I'm gonna check it out. But either way, I'm gonna come back whenever I get some food so I can show y'all what I get. I was trying to do something with my hair, but it looks a mess. So it is now 2.30 p.m. hours later. I can't even tell y'all like what literally was going on with me trying to order food. Both places that he had a menu for in the room, they were both closed. And one said it wasn't going to open until 2, but when I actually contacted them, they were like, they're actually doing a remodeling, so they're closed for two weeks. So then I had to contact um, Wilbert, and he was trying to find different places that could deliver, but also, only, but also took card because I have no cash on me. I always do this. And guys, don't be like me. Always make sure y'all have cash. Finally, we were able to find a place that took card and also delivered. And it's called Vista Verde. Uh, hold on. Hola. Hola. Mami, disculpe. Es que está viendo, está hablando con un muchacho ahorita del restaurante. So I'm back. I don't know where I stopped off, but basically, we finally found a place that took card and also delivered. I had to stop because he apparently the um, he only charged me the price for cash, so he asked. He also had to charge me the price for him delivering it. And when I just converted it, it was um it was four thousand colon, and that converted to like seven eight dollars us they taxed them i'm definitely gonna go get some um cash tomorrow because they are trying to tax for real oh it's about to rain okay so i got taco de pescado which are fish tacos and it looks so good oh my god i also got un casado con chuleta which is um pork chop i thought it was gonna be fried but it looks boiled mm. It still smells mad good. So I'm about to try the smoothie. Mmm. This is mad good. Oh sh. Oh sh. Oh no. I'm going inside. Look at. This. Appreciate you. Is that real? Look at this thing. I was sitting right there. Oh, nah. Oh, nah. All right, we won't eat right here. It's not even that I'm scared of the iguana. I just don't want it to like jump on my food or something. Like that put me off guard. And the funny thing is, where I was sitting, I didn't even see it from there. I seen the reflection in the glass mirror. So that thing would have been right by me and I wouldn't have known if I didn't see the reflection. That is crazy. Look at it. See? Now look where it's at. It literally, if I didn't, if I didn't see the reflection, it would have been right there by my freaking foot. And I wouldn't have even known. Oh my look at it. Look at it. Look at it, y'all. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Nah, that's OD. And it's staring at me. I could have just died. Like, I would've just been dead. This movie is mad good though. Let's try this fish taco. This looks so good. The iguana is still there. That is mad funny. It's the first thing I'm eating today and it's 2.46. Let's go. Mm. Mm. This is so good. Let me try with the sauce. Yeah. This is it. I'm sorry y'all, I'm so hungry. The casado, I'm gonna eat later for dinner. I literally bought two things thinking I was gonna eat it all now, but I can already tell this is gonna make me full. Okay, so let me put y'all on for the plans for tomorrow. As you guys know, tomorrow's my birthday. So right now the plan is at 8 a.m. I'm gonna meet Wilbur so we can go to the waterfall, which is located in this area. We're gonna walk over there. He said I can actually get into the water. Then I booked a massage for 12. But I might have to do that later in the day because I do need to um, go to the ATM and get cash because the massage, uh, the spa, they don't 
take a card. So I need, excuse me, I need cash for that. So I'm about to um, hit up Fabio on WhatsApp and see if he can take me to an ATM so I can get some money for not only that, but for food. So when I'm delivering, I don't have to worry about paying $7 for a delivery, which they're only a seven minute drive away. Like. That's OD. That's all for now. Um, I know the sun is about to go down, so I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna try to get some more pictures outside, and then I'll come to you guys later on. I don't know for what, but I'll come to you guys later. But yes, it's my birthday. Period. 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 Oh, for a minute I thought I had a nip. I'm about to be like, oh my god, I gotta record that whole thing. Over. Hey guys, so it's a few hours later. I just now set up my ring light. So right now I'm about to actually, actually I'm about to warm up my food that I got earlier and then I'm going to start making some TikToks. So should I turn this light? I don't know who's watching out there. Where's the light at? Is it here? Here we go. Let's get this food. So today was actually a great first day in Costa Rica. It was real chill, exactly how I wanted. There is dressing on the salad. And it still tastes fresh. Even though it's from earlier. Fun fact about me guys. I do not eat tomatoes. I hate tomatoes. I actually told y'all this in my um Colombia was it? No. Not my Colombia blah blah. My El Salvador blog. Because my host had actually made me breakfast and it had tomatoes in it. And I was so worried because I'm like, dang, like she put all this effort to like make me breakfast and like I'm not gonna like it. But I tried it and it was actually really, really good. So I had to tell her like I don't really eat tomatoes, but you made it in a way that I actually like it. And I was not gassing her. Like, it actually was. Ugh, just kidding. Me. It actually was really good. I'm about to try the rice beans and chuleta. And let y'all know what I think. I'm just mixing up the rice and the beans. Great. Here we go. Mmm. It's good, y'all. Before this trip, I've never had Costa Rican food before. But I would say it has like that, that typical... Latin American taste, if you know what I mean. Like if you if you try different Latin American foods, like y'all know what I mean. But now let me try the pork chop. I need a knife. It's good. I will say the cassava I had yesterday, uh, where Fabio took me, was definitely better than this one. But this one is still good. I rate this one like a eight out of ten, seven and a half out of ten. It's not bad. Go ahead. Say it again. Happy birthday, Chica. No. <laughs> Say what you said before. Happy birthday to the sexiest woman I know. I hey. remember it all. You, what was the last part you said? Now you gotta do it over. You gotta do it over again because I was eating chips. All right, put your face in the camera. Who's saying it, the fan or you? Mm, it's kind of, mm, my head looks crazy right now. Not work, no. You could barely see you. I got it on the full screen of me, not you. But happy birthday to this sexy woman I know. Happy birthday, babe. Thank you. Oh, it's officially my birthday here in Costa Rica. Very, 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 very. Yes. Good morning, guys. So, like I told you guys yesterday, I am going to the waterfall today. Right now, it's like 7.55, and I'm meeting Wilbur at 8. So, I'm literally about to just sit on the patio outside my room for him, and we're going to make our way to the waterfall. I'm going to show you guys my full outfit later. And for the hike, because he did say it um, is a hike, I'm just wearing my water shoes, but I actually have some shoes for this outfit for me to take pictures in. Hopefully... It's not as hot as it was the other day that my camera gets foggy. Oh my God, look at the doggy. I know I saw it in the reviews, they said they had a dog. Hi, hi, hi. Aw, so cute. So pretty. Hi. Okay, you ready? I am. Okay. Thank you. you. Okay. Everything's okay now? Everything's good. The house okay. is so beautiful. Oh my okay. gosh. I love it. Sleep good. Yes. Everything is so amazing. Okay. Vámonos. Okay. Esperemos que disfrutes esta pequeña aventura. Vamos a bajar por aquí porque es un sendero 
aquí un poco de, de, de plantas naturales Ajá. y descendemos abajo y caminamos un poquito por la montaña hasta la cascada. La idea de, de, de esto, Dani, Ajá. esto porque con esto tú tienes, por ejemplo, pones este Ajá. y tu estabilidad. Ah, ok, ok. Esta es la banana planta. Oh. La planta, uy, tío. Bueno. <risa> Gracias. <risa> Esta oh es my la God. Esta planta Ajá. allá tiene la fruta Ajá. que es verde. Cuando es lista para el mono es amarilla. Ah. Y el mono, oh, like it. Oh. Este es tu pineapple plant. Oh. Esta es planta de piña. Esta ah. planta es la planta de una fruta que se llama guava, que es una fruta que se come tropical dulce. Este trabaja con. con con, con YouTube. Uh -huh. Ve, esta es la planta. Y hoy es mi cumpleaños. Oh, happy birthday. <ríe> Gracias. <ríe> Gracias. Muchas felicidades. Muchas bendiciones, Dios. Muchos, muchos años más para Dani. Dani, aquí voy a poner los steps. Los steps aquí. Okay. Okay. Pones eso y pones el pie. Ok. Los pasos, con cuidado. Vamos a tratar de marcarlos para. Vamos. Oh. Eso, pongo el pie aquí. Normalmente, yeah. Dani, uh, my boss is saying no like the get inside to the mountain, inside to the waterfall. ¿Por qué? Porque el jefe es un momento. Ok. Extraño lo que él tiene. Él tiene un pequeñito brush. Ya está como muy seco. Este brush. Es more strong uh -huh. in the tree. Uh -huh. The monkey go a lot around for the mountain. It had to insect animal uh -huh. go to the tree uh -huh. and put to, and clean. Ah. Clean, 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 clean. One more clean, 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 clean. We get ready. Uh -huh. Oh wow! Go. This is the tree. Wow, that's so cool. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, let's see. Aquí vamos a pasar este algo. No dangerous. Ok. Cámara. Y hacemos como un poquito de abajo. Aquí. Y aquí. Por debajo. Exactamente. Perfecto. Every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it. Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up high. I was not expecting this. Look, I am sweating. Oh my God. As y'all can see, I was not prepared for this, okay? He said hike. I didn't know he meant hike, hike. My shirt is all nasty, but it's worth the experience, definitely. Hands up high. Hands up high. Tell them dim the lights down right now. Put me in the mood. Gracias. Con gusto, Dani. Dos opciones. Caminamos aquí por un pequeño camino para caminar allá. Ok. O tenemos una road. La cuerda. Um, oh my god, no sé. Recognize your fragrance, hold up, you ain't never gotta say shit, uh, and I know you taste this a little bit, mm, high maintenance, uh, everybody else basic, you live life on an everyday basis, with poetic justice, poetic justice, I don't know if I could do that, I will bloom in the dark room, what you trusted, I mean, I write poems in these songs, you're in the mood for empathy, it's blood in my pen, better yet with your friends and him, I really want to, okay guys, so Fabio's here, Okay guys, so I'm back at the house, obviously, and right now I'm about to choose between one of these. I had this one before. I don't recall ever having this one, hot sauce with chicken. So I'm gonna try this one. I literally bought this in the market, but I really wanted to get some food on my way back here. But I stopped at Vista Birthday, the place that I got food from yesterday, and they were closed until 2 p.m. Mm. Good. I'm gonna make this soup and then after my massage, I'm gonna order some dinner. I really did want to go to the national park and the beach, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to do that only because this trip was for number one for me to relax and number two for me to get content. 
and I've only got one set of pictures which I posted today because it's my birthday so make sure y'all follow me on Instagram to go check out those pictures and yeah I have three more fits I gotta take pictures in and like one more full day left and I really don't want to risk going out tomorrow and then not having time to take my pictures because I'm going to be so upset if I don't get the pictures I'd be more upset if I don't get the pictures other than if I don't go to um, the park. I can always come back to go to and go there. They said in the reviews for this listing that being here is just like being at the park. Like you see the same animals. The only thing I did have not seen so far is the sloth, but I have seen the momos, I have seen the iguanas. Um, and then on the hike today, I seen uh, a few animals too. But that hike was enough for me. Like I was not ready for it. I saw so that's what I was wearing. When he said it was gonna be a hike, I'm thinking, okay, a little cute one too. Especially because I was gonna go by myself. And he was like, oh no, nah, if you want, like I'll take you. And I'm like, all right, since so you're insisting, like sure you could take me. But when I had um, Googled it, it said it was gonna be an eight minute walk. It took us like an hour to get over there. Thank you guys so much for bringing me back here safe when it came to that waterfall and i was going up the rope obviously i did not get a chance to record that but i was on top of that rope my legs started quivering i'm like oh my god god please don't let me die in this country please don't let me die in this country please 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 <laughs> please don't let me die in this country people that know me like y'all y'all see my vlogs before y'all know the crazy stuff i do i am all with crazy stuff but it's the fact that i'm on top of a hill one of my what if i had to pick like a random fear that's not really a fear but if i was put in a position like i would be scared it would happen would be falling from a waterfall or like falling from a cliff with mad rocks because that to me oh my god it just sounds so bad like you fall off a cliff with mad rocks and it just gives you that opportunity to like hit all those rocks and oh my god hit your head up so it's the fact that i'm literally on top of this cliff mad rocks it's not like it's a it's not like it's deep so you can't, you can't, it's not somewhere you can dive because it's not deep enough to dive. So if I fall, I'm falling on rocks. And the difference between that and like when I do other stuff, it's like I be having like equipment. Like, you know, they have the helmets, they have the harnesses. I ain't have no harness. So if I fell, that's it. It started creeping up to me once I finally got on top of the cliff after we climbed the rope. My legs started shivering. I'm like, yeah, no, God, please take me back. And thankfully... I, I'm surprised myself. I literally did not fall. Like I slipped a few times, like but I didn't fall. I know myself. I'm so clumsy. Like I was so prepared to fall. Once I saw what we were heading for, I'm like, oh my gosh. But Wilbur was so sweet, so so nice. He explained everything to me, and it was just a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful sight. Like it was gorgeous. That was like the best thing I could have did for my birthday. So I'm happy I was able to do that. Hopefully this vlog is not so boring, not too boring, since that's literally like the only excursion that I did. I literally was getting a massage in the rain like imagine getting a massage in the middle of the jungle with rain sounds like that was amazing jump scare my fool tell me why that there was just a powder outage like I'm literally good thing I have this light I would literally be here in the pitch black tell me why I'm literally on TikTok while I'm doing my makeup and out of nowhere the power just goes out i'm not really thinking nothing of it because mind you i'm in here with this light so it didn't look that bad but i did peek that the bathroom lights came on and then i looked back and i'm like oh shit, all the lights came out hopefully it don't take forever to come back on because i'm literally only doing my makeup so i can take pictures and, and uh do a reel and how am i gonna do the reel with no freaking lights like that's crazy um it's oh my god thank you lord jesus it was only out for like a few minutes probably like five minutes honestly i wasn't that worried i figured it was gonna come back on because this happens a lot in the yard like that happens all the time in the yard i wasn't expecting it to come on this soon but i'm glad it did because i do have work to do i could probably actually sometimes i'll be here actually 
See, the only thing about hearing stuff in here is like, even if I was to go to the window, like, I can't see outside because it's pitch black. So, even if there was a killer out there or something, like, they would be seeing me and I would not see them unless I go all the way to the glass and press my eyes <laughs> there. Um, I'm not really doing much today but TikToks. So, I might record me a little bit doing that. If not, you guys will be seeing me tomorrow. Talk to y'all later. Fell like my vision a little bigger than a bigger picture. Crazy, yeah, you gotta wait until it's dark out. Okay, guys, so I've been out here for about an hour and a half taking pictures, and it's only because when I first started, the sun was like blasting and looking so good, and then all of a sudden it just went away. So I was still trying to get the pic the same quality pictures that I was getting when I first started um, without the sun for like a good hour, and then finally the sun came back out. So I was able to get some more pictures. You know, I still have not even ate breakfast yet. That restaurant never texted me back. They said they didn't they didn't open till seven. And I texted them at seven and they still didn't answer. So I'm about to call a restaurant right now because I'm starving. And also change into my next fit. So we got one picture down, one set of pictures down, two more to go, y'all. It's 9.30. Y'all think we could do it? I know we can. Only thing is, the sun goes down really, really early. Like, by like 3, it's like, it or 8. My breakfast is finally here. I'm so happy because I'm so freaking hungry. I got one pipico, which is a traditional Costa Rican, Costa Rican breakfast. And it came mad fast. They literally came in like 10 minutes. I got another pipico, but this time I got guava. The um, express time is so nice. But they do just means um, smoothie, like shake. Let's try it. Mmm. Not good. I'm putting it in this glass though because I'm gonna try to take pictures with it. My food, my food, my food. Ooh, look. Y'all, look how good this looks. Oh my god. So I just finished taking my last set of pictures. I'm so hyped. Like I actually got four sets of pictures. It is 317. I'm gonna order some food for lunch and for for dinner. And then I'm just gonna do TikToks for the rest of the day. I definitely do wanna go for a final swim in this pool because it's so freaking beautiful. I will see y'all later. Look what I have. Ben! <laughs> She's so cute. Right now, it is 6.33 and I just got another delivery. I ordered from the um, St. Delivery guy just because when he came, he was so nice earlier. I'm like, yeah, I'm just going to use you. He gave me his um, his card so I can co contact him directly. Um, so I was like, you know what? I was going to order from a different restaurant, but I'm like, you know what? I might as well use him. He already has the gate code. Um, he knows where the place is. So might as well. And he's super, super nice. I can't believe tomorrow I'm leaving, y'all. Like, I'm really leaving tomorrow. Like, that shit is crazy. I ordered... What did I order? Not that. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, this looks good. I got um a chalupa and it looks like this. Oh my god. But those tomatoes gotta come off. I also got ceviche. I got a strip ceviche, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I also got a limonada. You know me, I love my lemonade. Let me actually try the ceviche. Let me try the ceviche. Y'all yeah, cannot wait until I get my house in the Caribbean somewhere. Like I really want to get one in VR, but honestly, after going to Colombia, like, I think I like Colombia better than uh, DR, to be honest. I haven't been to DR since 2020, so maybe it's me not, wait, I think 2021, actually. But maybe it's me just not have been there for a while, I don't know, but. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's good. Okay guys, so it's my last day. I literally set an alarm for 5 a.m. on the dot so I can watch the sunset. I literally just got up, didn't brush my teeth, didn't wash my face or anything. My alarm went on and I woke straight up. So I'm gonna walk upstairs to the pool.
too hot like a furnace. Got a hundred G's, I'ma go y'all. My diamonds don't shine when the lights dark. You and I take a ride down the boulevard. Me and your friends really wanna break us apart. Good boy. Good place. Staring at my diamond while I'm hopping out of spaceship. Your information, take vacation to Malaysia. Keep my faith, get the pepper, press it, press it, crazy. Just drink the bottle while I sit back and smoke gelato.